What do we got here? <clears throat> it's a classic first person perspective body. And then you have it kind of out facing the world. And then you have all these ideas that show up. And all these ideas are bing, 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 bing. And all those govern your existence. Like a heads up display of a hologram. And so what's said is, well, what if actually this had nothing in its heads up display? It was totally empty, like this. No name, time, location, identity, information whatsoever, but you were able to access your zip code or whatever social when you needed to, but not that those things identified you. So then you could feel what the nature is of this empty space, like the sky, you know, basically like this, open, empty, no, no identifiers. And then on Earth, you could feel all of those different differentiators and identifiers when you need them, but you weren't identified with them. And you see like this fish eye perspective is also really important because if you're living kind of on this perspective, very zoomed in, you're very zoomed in and focused, right? And it's very difficult to get you to zoom out. And when you zoom out, you can focus more, more on like the bigger picture on the open space instead of just on the single object. So it's like that and that. This is like your name and your personality and all your attributes and identifiers and features. And this is the feature list without any identifiers or attributes, the open space that everything shares. Quack, 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 quack. 